those unknown soldiers and the and whoever it is and all those people in power today. You are in power today, but you can never be in power forever. You will never be in power forever. And God has a way of punishing everyone. Whatever you do in this life, you will repeat. If you don't repeat, your children will repeat. If your children don't repeat, your children's children will repeat. If your children's children will be your generation will repeat, and you will repeat. You will even repeat. Forget. You will repeat whatever we sow in this life. You will reap. Go back and check all those our leaders then. A lot of them are battling sickness, illness. A lot of them are going through a whole, a whole lot that they cannot come out to see. We see them in their badders and in their flashy cars, but what they go through, what they, what they go through in their families, their homes, their children. You see a lot of them. God is punishing them on this earth. And that is how he will punish every soul that was involved in the killings of those innocent um, souls that died at that same Toki. Uh, like uh, Toki. Um, yeah, I said to, uh, like it took it. Government, you I don't know which of you is watching my life program. You better leave those children. I be the children. Sorry. You better leave those uh, youths alone. Leave them on. Free all of them on. Not just Mr. Macaroni, every single one of them. Because they have a right. They have a right to protest, they have a right to hear their voice and their views. They didn't go there with um, guns or cutlasses. They didn't attack you people. And it is, it is really very shameful that you can be dehumanizing your own children because they are your own children too. It's really, it's, it's a shame. It is well, it is well with Nigeria. I don't even know. Is it even well with Nigeria? Do you anyway? Fact. <laughs> may God, may God, may God just help us in this. May God just help us in this country. I want Romi It's a lot, a lot of, a lot. The government has failed in so many ways, and they are still failing. They are still failing in so many ways. Innocent souls died. You guys said you're setting up a panel. That panel that you set up, that corrupt panel, at the end of the day, what happened? And then now, how many months ago was this? Was it about? Was it in October, November? Was it November, October? I think it was in October, November, December. Yes, October twentieth, I think. November, December, January. Yeah. And even up to four months, and then you people, you want to reopen uh, two gates. That two gates, when it was there. The kind of traffic that it was causing, generating. Yeah, and now you want to bring that same. You want to bring. You don't even. You there's no there's no respect for the dead. Nothing. Yes, coming. It's cr it's really crazy. It's really 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 crazy. Honestly, it's really crazy. Yes. Okay. It's really crazy. <laughs> Government, you have failed though. People have failed woefully. I'm so disappointed, honestly. I'm really very dis disappointed. I mean, it's one thing for you to want to 
um, ex exercise your your powers by arresting those people and not allowing them protest is another thing for you to dehumanize them like that. Can imagine you packing them up like that and tying them up and throwing them and well, uh, uh, some stupid policemen they said, put your face down, put your face down. You, Mr. Macaroni, why are you? Eh, why you why are you put yourself for this kind of So what is the democracy that we are doing? And Jaku Padas military regime. Kakumu yes, military regime awa. But because of you people's selfish interest, because of the money that you people want to be packing and stealing, you people will say no, uh, it's, it's democracy. There's no democracy. There's no democracy in Nigeria. There's no democracy in Nigeria. The, why, why inflict so much pain on them? Just because they felt the need that they need to. To, to go out there and air their voice and 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 and, 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 and have a peaceful protest. There's no democracy in Nigeria. No democracy at all. We should just forget. Yes. We are used to that regime, so we rather buy. They should take it so that we know, so that when they are maltreating us or dehumanizing us or doing all this, we understand that okay, this is the kind of government we are practicing. We understand it's to be acceptable to us. It's not that you people will now come and say you are democracy, we are democracy, just because of what they feel could do, to do to they feel judge, to do only they feel judge. It's democracy, it's democracy, it's democracy. And then when it's time for us to exercise that democracy, that our rights that you that you all claim that we have, uh, the next minute you show your power. You show that yes, we are not in a democracy. Uh, a, a democracy. We are not we are, imagine show you so jari. It is well. as well. We are practicing we are practicing democracy just to enrich our pockets in here. In this part of our own country. That is my own take. Democracy time practice do we run and that's the fact. Because you don't have a right to talk. If I carry myself now I go stand for this so they will arrest me. They go beat me. They go dehumanize me. We cannot talk in peace. Hmm? The last time they froze some people's accounts. Some people they didn't allow them to travel. Even some had to run out of this country. And then every day we talk about uh, we should go to Nigeria. We need to develop Nigeria. We need to do what? 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 Ah! That was simply for Nigeria, no. Because this country, as it is, uh, zero. Tell me one good thing that we have in this country that works well. Nothing. One good thing that we have. Today, today, Nepal, they brought this letter and taken it a hundred times. They increase Nepal bill. Still yet, it doesn't mean that we're having the Nepal itself. They bring it in a small time, they take it, take it for the hours. They won't give you. When they bring your bill, it's overrated. Yeah. You buy, uh, you have a meter. The rate at which your car will be flying, you'll be wondering what happened to you in this same Nigeria. The health system. Mm -hmm. Educational system. Mm -hmm. uh, people are going into headsmen, they're going into people's farm, killing people, you know, doing a whole lot. Kidnapping, book them. Government, a to to deploy. Look at the way. And I'm like, this so we have this. And we are still having issues with Boko Haram. 
Hmm? Now go the flex on our power for people. We know we we, we no get any weapon, nothing to fight you except this our mouth. Now the flex power. The people we get weapon. We we they we they they ready to face on our go the run. They will say we are practicing democracy. It's only God that can help us. Because when I go what is shape for one in Nigeria, I come up what is shape for one. Why, why dehumanize them? That's my, my own edict right now. Have you ever seen, seen that video? Ah. Please, nothing should happen to those people. Nothing should happen to those people. Hmm. Huh. And uh, Governor Sonwolu. Nothing should happen to those people. Because <laughs> people should not come and be giving us different stories. So like the last time, we have not gotten over it all. They give us one story today, tomorrow they give us one story, then they send investigative journalists to come, special investigative journalists from Abuja, to come and start putting his hand at his back and be walking up and down, looking at evidence. So all that one should not happen this time around. <laughs> doesn't make any sense. Even if people are not happy with the fact that uh, they came out to protest and the new people decide to arrest them, they, have, they still have a right. Even if you arrest them, they have a right to a lawyer. They have a right. They have, they have a right. They should have a right. You cannot just come and pack them like criminals and treat them like, 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 like armed robbers. I have one story. We should leave Mr. Macaroni and the rest of them. Ah, story. Ah, ni ah ni koko but our voice is stronger. This is well. Hey people, you know me. I cannot see something and not talk. God help me. I can't see something that is wrong with this my country. And I will not give my own um, opinion about it or say my mind. I'll talk my talk. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'll say my own. Me have Koku said it. All this APC, PDP, Mbano, for me, it's a never, never. God help us in this country. This country is every man for himself. God just help us all. Please, they should free, they should free these people, they should free them, they should free all these peaceful protesters, they should leave them alone. A lot of parents lost their children during the last um, uh, to, uh, Lucky to Gate massacre. A lot of parents, they've not gotten over it. Any Kolomo, a lot of parents are crying and mourning. They can never get over the loss of their child. Even the ones that died and they saw, it's different. Some people, some, some mothers or fathers, or they don't even know where their children are. They can't find their their, their children's um, dead body to even say, okay, let me they, they, let me bury them. Don't you know that they don't they, they can't have peace? And as and as far as you people have not given those people those uh, people peace, you do you people will never know peace. All of you that that you are involved in the in in, in the in the in the uh, Lekki Togate massacre, you people will never know peace. Because a lot of parents are out there, they don't they don't have peace because they've not been able to bury their loved ones. They've not been able to give their loved ones a befitting barrier. They've not been able to find closure. They've not <clears throat> When you lose someone dead to you, that's when you know that until you put that person to, to rest, until you lay that person to rest, you can never find closure. It's not possible. I remember when my mom died, like, I had to bury her so fast because I could not find closure. I could not, like, I was, in a, I was in a world of my own. I Even despite the fact that I had millions of people coming around me, I was even posting on Instagram, but I was not myself until I saw her lead to rest. And I knew that, okay, she's gone to, and I had to console myself that, oh, she's gone to a better place. So I can imagine mothers, and this is, this is my own mother, an elderly woman. So all of my 
in a lot of mothers are out there, but you know, they probably might be afraid. A lot of them must have even gone around. They don't, who will take it up when we don't have a good system that can fight for them? Where? Every you try to talk, they will silence you. They will threaten you. That's the, that's the destiny. Nigerians, uh, our government, that's what they do. They threaten you. They silence you. They tag you as a bad person. They frustrate you. That's why I see that some people, uh, it's generations to come, they can never know peace. Their generations can never know peace. They should free these people all. That's my own take. They should free them. They have a right to protest. As long as, even though we know that we are not fully practicing democracy, now on our we did democracy government. And for that, they have a right to their own thing. They have a right to protest as long as they are not vandalizing or abusing or assaulting anybody. And I don't show power and I don't arrest them. Good. But dehumanizing them and treating them bad and doing all those things is wrong. When 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 Wahala starts now, now go begin talk say Wahala they, they don't they don't they they, they, are, they are destroying the uh, country a bit there. You people will st you people will start the Wahala now. You and you people will still be the ones to come out and be giving us different story. Lie up and down, flying here and there, deceiving yourself, acting like stupid old idiots. Anyway, it is well. God, God help us in this country. Please, they should free me, Mr. Mr. Macaroni and the rest of them, all of them. What they call, what they Can't you arrest somebody without treating that person like an animal? You people are the ones breeding all this. And you see, most of these youths that you say they are hungry, they are violent. It is you people breeding them. It is you people, you this government, you are the one breeding it. Can, can't you arrest? Okay, you arrest them. Maybe you put them behind bars. They have a right to call their lawyer. They will grant them bail, definitely. Baby, can't you follow the system? It wasn't as if when you got there, they were fighting you people or they were attacking themselves or they killed anybody or they wound anybody. I mean, this is this a law. Why can't we would like to copy the Western world a lot, right? But why is it that our heart is still very black? Must you always, I mean, exercise that power? I don't understand. I don't even know these police women, police people safe. We are all <laughs> anyway. I don't know. They, don't let me. That was a, that's even another story for another day. It's just very crazy. And there's a lot of misplaced priorities going on in the government system. A lot. The government will just throw away their face. As long as it's not benefiting them, they will throw away their face. You are worried about Lekki Togit, about reopening it and generating money from it. You are not worried about the thousands of kids on this lake, this same Lekki road. You see kids, they come out in their numbers to beg money. Stupid hoodlums use, use these children and some stupid adults will use them, put them on the streets to be begging, to be... That's child abuse. When they're supposed to be in, the, in school, they put them there, those ones will be running around, and then when, they, when, when, they, when we give them money, they will take this, when we give them money, they will take this money, and then those, those hoodlums, those useless hoodlums, or whoever it is, to collect the money from them and maybe give them food and food. put them on the streets right under your nose there's child trafficking right under your nose there's child abuse in this same lucky oh this same lucky you people did not see that one oh you didn't see it to clear those kids off the road oh 
it's people that are going back there and uh, going uh, about their own doing peaceful protests that you are flexing all your muscles for. Why don't you put your CID police there to catch all these people, take all these children off the streets, take them to somewhere where they can take care of them? Sometimes I wonder, do we don't have leaders? So many of them on this lucky, like I saw, it's not, it's not that um, I saw young uh, hoodlums, stupid young guys, gathering those children together and collecting all the money that people have been giving them. They collected it from those people and then they were even warning them. I don't even know what they were saying because, you know, I was driving and then they, they, they left and those kids came back on the road begging for money. Sometimes some will try and do like they want to clean your windows. and There are plenty on this same lucky road. You people, you didn't see that one. Hey, Kojan lucky, hey, 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 you see it and then you ignore. Then these kids, we, we grow up in, in, in a very hostile environment. Grow up in a very terrible condition, uh, uh, condition be whatever. Then they become hardened criminals. And then you begin to run, run about. The, the demons that you people created yourself. When you're supposed to go there, take them off the street, put them in good homes and schools, give them good life and good education. But you are worried. You are worried about the money that you have not collected from to get. And the democracy time, she democracy lori run. Iro, 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 iro. Lori on that fake J, on that fake J, kujeke bon, kujeke mo the right thing to eke she. Kujeke kujeke mo the right things to eke she lala. And whatever you do, your children, you, your generations, they will suffer it. If you like, don't change your ways. Mm -hmm. Be there. We should free these people. They should leave them. People are angry. There's no good job anywhere. There's no money. We are all, eh, I mean, I don't know about other people, but we want that more struggle. I have to do over, over about eight business to survive. Me. I If we are, if we are in a good country, well, anyway. Mm -hmm. Just, I'm just. People should free them. Mm -hmm. And free one. It is well. Guys, let me go off, Charlie. It's only God that can that can free this that can that can that can help this country. Bolatifebere. Ibolatifebere. Where do we start from in this country? Number one, there's no love. There's no love. Between we. The Yoruba, the Igbo, the Aousa together, no love. We have to deal with that one. We have not finished dealing with that one. They will come. They say there's corruption. Motobila no gone corrupt. We have to deal with that one. Bad governance. No food, no water, no clothes, no this, no that, no this, no that. Everybody's just suffering and smiling. Even the so called rich, they are all suffering and smiling. No, back, go back. Oh, bar the most expensive car. You go see enter galop. Possible. This same traffic will enter it together. So what are we talking about? Pollution everywhere. That's it. Oh. Mm.